So we're creating our first data hub. Where do we start? So where we recommend that you start is with a data services first approach to data integration. And what that means is you think about your business requirements. What are you trying to deliver for your customer? And you find the data that you need to meet those requirements. You integrate it in a way to meet those requirements so that you can deliver to them something that they can use. And you can do that fast. And then you repeat that process to build on that and deliver more and more requirements in an agile way. And in our example, what we're going to do is build some applications for a financial services customer. So let's imagine that we're working with the investment research side of a financial services organization. And what our customer wants to be able to do is do analysis on companies that are within the Fortune 500 as well as some companies that are outside of the Fortune 500 and be able to look at things like profit margin and number of employees and industry and location to do some analytics on that type of data. Okay. So you mentioned using the Data Hub framework to accelerate the process of building a Data Hub, but how do we do that? How do we get started? So the Data Hub framework makes it easy, and there's a tool that you can grab as a developer, and it's called the Quick Start User Interface. And what I want you all to do is grab that tool, because that's what we're going to be using as we go through some of these hands-on examples. And the link to download that Quick Start is right here on the site for you to use. All right. Can we get started? Let's do it.